So you're playing Marvel Snap Ladder and you keep bumping into Hella. As a matter of fact, we did bump into Hella very many times tonight, but this deck still worked out pretty good in our favor. This deck we labeled as Hella Killers, but unfortunately we didn't really see a whole lot of Hella killing because we didn't see Hella very much. But this is an affliction based deck and we got Cosmo in the mix as well. Uh, Cosmo can save the day in many situations, uh, especially when you put down US Agent, you can kind of you know, persuade where your opponent wants to play their Hella. Cause you don't want Hella to get hit by US Agent because it's gonna be a lot worse than say for instance, Infinite getting hit by it or Giganto if it gets dropped down. So uh, this deck just focuses on that. Now we do have Hazmat in here because you're gonna be running with Ajax and trying to get as much affliction as possible. And I know what you're gonna say. You got High Evolutionary in here just for one card. Abomination is not just one card when you think about it. He's really he's really a tremendous help getting a lot of power, especially when you're dropping the power of all of the cards on the field that your opponent and yourself have. You don't have Luke Cage in this deck. We do have Rogue though, so if your opponent has Luke Cage, you can steal it. Uh, but I digress. Abomination being a 0-9 on turn six is phenomenal. Exa uh, especially if you've got Ajax down and Ajax, uh, you can go to from Mystique. You can go to Mystique after Ajax to Abomination, and and you can lay down Hazmat. That's a lot of power on that turn six, especially if you don't have Pryo coming into that. So it can be really nice. And also High Evolutionary has some uh, some good synergy with Man Thing. Um, also with US Agent, if you throw him on the US Agent because you have to, he's still gonna be a two a two power card, which is decent when you got us agent over there taking four power from a lot of cards you want to have at least something over there that's good so um all around the deck did pretty decent really enjoyed playing with it I, like i said i didn't see hella a lot but if we would have we probably could have prevented it um so pretty solid deck hope you guys enjoy hope you guys are enjoying the enjoying Hope you're enjoying the consistent content that we've been pouring out every single day over here on uh, the channel. And thank you for watching it. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace. Look at him. Does War Machine override Space Throne? Sure does. Doesn't give a goddamn about it. He overrides every location. Thank you was on the clock for a retreat. Huh? I don't think this guy is playing very much. Um, A uh, big card. He's a small. I think he's a small card, Samantha. Well, okay, we're talking about with potatoes instead of meat. As a meat lover, that hurts every fiber in my body. Well, meat hurts every fiber in my body because I have gout. <laughs> well. Your words, they hurt. <laughs> we gotta do earlier hazmats in this day. Mm. I think the later hazmat is fine. The real question is, is this guy going to be playing? Um, I feel like he's going to play. I kind of want. This is fine. Which is fine. Maybe magic for extra turn? Nah. We got him right now. He's not playing anything over here this turn. Only thing I'm afraid of is probably Shang-Chi if he has it. 
Not if he fills the middle, though. I think he's going to try to give me that. Oh, no, he destroyed it. Oh, well, that works out still. We still get a zero abomination. Great. So we got a big play coming up. We have a big turn play right here. So we're going to play Mystique over here on the US agent. Copy that. Abomination over here on the left, as well as Cosmo. We did not get what we really wanted, but that's fine. I think that's fine. Don't copy Ajax? Why? Yeah, we're copying Ajax. Oh, I'm sorry. We're gonna put it in the lane with US Agent, but we're copying Ajax. Yeah, we're still gonna do a plus six over here. How's my day today? My day was pretty good. It was, it's really hot outside, but we uh we went to go do some errands and stuff and well not nah, went to Korean barbecue. But I feel like maybe it might even be better if I do I'm gonna cancel out that deck as if your opponent has the same deck. Yeah. Well this would this wouldn't be good. This only reason I don't want to play this over here because of that. But I think this is fine. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we're up to here. No beast. Werewolf. My widow actually helps us a little bit. Great. Nice try, infected. You are indeed infected. Yep, he's got the ick all over him. Look at him. It's all nasty and gross. He tried to get rid of this Nico, but it wasn't gonna work. We weren't gonna allow it. King Batman. I thought Batman was already kind of the king because that was kind of his day, his thing. I think that the abomination also just like makes him, I mean, the, the, oh, having the abomination, the only card that I have with high Evo makes it kind of a surprise. Hopefully because I use the PAX code, it should be easier to get my account back. Hmm. Hopefully so. Oh, it's the, it's the backs, the building. We'll be holding off on playing anything. That's not fair. I hope I hit his human torch. Back to the build is the hot location. Oh, I had no idea. Sometimes I forget hot locations are a thing. It's a shame they don't have any sinister to go. What do you mean? You can hide them all behind invisible woman and then, and then they'll come out and you'll be like, ah, <laughs> oh, town loons a hot location. Oh, hmm. No loot cage in this deck? Nah, you want to be able to suck some of the power off of your cards, too. Kind of afraid of this. We'll, we'll make do. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, he made his decision. I 
I'm not sure why he did it, but he made his decision. Now you can't take it back. <laughs> Goodbye, King Batman. I feel sorry for you, but not enough to fist bump because that was the, oh, the old echo blindness. The old echo blindness. Yes. <laughs> what is I was like, what is this? You know, like I, I don't know what see out see in is and all this stuff. You know, I was like, what is you have to do a lot of stuff. You have to do a lot of stuff the right way and you don't you don't mess it up, you know, but it was I, I didn't. I made a lot of good friends there. I think that was a good thing to have. I think that was an awesome thing to have some good friends. Thing called like making instructions for a baby. Yeah, it's like you don't know you you literally encoding. You end up just figuring it out yourself. That's what's sad about it. You just figure it out for yourself. That's basically what you're gonna have to do. All right, Luffy, I gotta go show Perry some love. Yo, no, no problem, dude. Yeah, go tell go tell Perry I say hey. I don't know what I want to do here. We could lay down Cosmo. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's the stuff. That's the stuff. <laughs> this guy just looked over his shoulder. He was like, <laughs> he was like, yo. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, this guy is checking his computer right now for spyware. He's like, what is going on? Why? <laughs> why would you? Why would you play Cosmo over there? Dude, it was a whim. <laughs> it was just a whim. <laughs> oh, man. And, um, the ones that I spent money on, no one ever uses. I, if that's one tip I could give somebody who wants to become a content creator. It's emotes are like Emotes are like uh, cat toys. The ones you spend money on, the cats will just play in the box. You know what I mean? They'll just play in the box. They'll just you don't have to spend money on a cat to keep it to keep it happy. <laughs> Thank you for the uh, the Sentinels, my dude. I'm, I appreciate that. Yeah, it was nice of you. It's real nice of you, my dude. I am going to put all of those underneath Cosmo and Cosmo is going to go on danger room and he is, what is, what is up with this? Cosmo is going to go on danger room and Cosmo is not going to blow up because Cosmo is a good boy and he's, he's got a space suit and he's cute. He's licking his dog bowl thing. It's in his helmet. It's crazy. He's going to live. Cosmo is a good boy. Uh, w in chat for Cosmo, guys. He's gonna live. W's in chat. He's living. He's living, guys. Told ya. W for Cosmo. He's living, baby. He's living like Laryl. What, what, what? Oh, this guy's playing. I didn't even realize that. I had no idea that that's what he was playing. Animal cruelty should not be tolerated. Let me tell you something about toleration. No. <laughs> He's not, there's no, there's no animal cruelty here. He's fine. This is safe room. He's, he's, he's literally just living, you know, he's, he's living his best life. What are we doing here? Should I copy Cosmo? I'm winning everywhere. Sure. Why would he do that? What is that? What are you doing? Oh. Interesting. Was not expecting this. That's fine though. Why would you do that, you jack wagon? You hurt yourself. Why would you do that? Yeah, you made a mistake. 
You made a big mistake. I don't, I'm not sure why you would want to do that, but hey, to each his own. And if that's Galactus, I don't care. Oh, well, we still win. We still win. <laughs> he, he almost got me, but he didn't. <laughs> but he, did. he actually got half-baked casserole. <laughs> this man was doing a lot to, to I, I guess that maybe he was trying to bamboozle me and make me think that, you know, we're fine. Look at US agent doing his thing over here. Look at it. Oh. I know you guys are still here. Well, while you're sticking around, be sure to subscribe and also check out this video. See you guys in later. Bye.